what is going on guys welcome back to another episode of pokemon shield nuzlocke um last episode unfortunately if you've watched it we did lose our starting pokemon kickups in the, against cuba and the fire gym and we also lost cloudy as well um, um in the last last episode so we've had to bring out our two catcher pokemon we have frogger um that we would be capture frogger in the motorstock outskirts and we also got a um, ringworm in the second gala mine um so they're into the team i've also trained my pokemon a little bit in the wildlands um just to get a few extra levels upon the pokemon um as i feel like they were a bit low um uh, from the last battle um so we got them up a little bit not too much um time consuming but we got them up a little bit um so we're gonna head off into Hammerlock, which is straight directly in front of us. There was not much to see or record, it was just me getting here. Um, but I'm here now, so we've got our three badges. So you need a few badges. You need the the grass, the water, and the fire gym to actually go beyond this point. Which we, we do have, so it's all good. We will be capturing our next Pokemon in this episode, I would, I would imagine, in Route 6. Just got to do a few things in this city here. Um, there's actually a gym in here, but it's actually the last gym badge. Um, the Dragon Gym, but we don't actually do the Dragon Gym just yet. It's near the end. The wonderful castle of Hammerlock. Okay guys, welcome back. Um yeah, basically what I've just done there is I spoke to Rose, he's told me about um trying to save energy or bring energy to the Gala region and um, with his power plants. I've just Spoke to the Dragon Gym Leader just then in the vault um, and, and Sonya about the legend as well. Um, again, my playlist for Pokemon Sword is below. You can actually check that out where you'll see um, those ep episodes will help a bit more evolve around the story. But this is a Nuzlocke. The aim is trying to get through this game without having a game over and losing all our Pokemon. Um, so that's all that was. It wasn't that important. But this is the guy here, right? This is where we get our revolt. If you've got an Appen, we speak to this kid here. He asks about if I've got a, um, an Aplum. You heard the rumour, I haven't. There we go. I pressed the wrong button. But if you pass him an Aplum, you, you, you won't lose your Aplum, so don't worry. So I say yes, I've got an Aplum. I hand over the ha Aplum. And he wants to play it off with some girl with an Aplum. Apparently this, this thing. It's a Pokemon thing, I don't know. But he tries to flirt with this girl, um, tell how he feels with this Applem. Um, I don't know if it works, but she ends up giving the Applem back, and then we get the Applem back off him, and he also gives us a, um, I'm sure some sort of like an apple, apple tart or something that we can put on to um, our Miss Forbidden. Um, yeah, let's say congratulations. There we go, we got his hopes up. <laughs> okay, we have our apple back. And we also get a sweet apple. That's what it's called, a sweet apple. And now we're going to give this to our apple. Apple's not a very strong Pokemon, doesn't really learn any moves. But yeah, we have... Where is the item? Where is the item? A sweet apple. Here we go. I use a sweet apple. I'm Miss Forbidden. It's time for Miss Forbidden to evolve. And there we have it. Miss Forbidden has evolved into an apple turn. So you get apple turn on shield and you get a frapple on sword. There we go. Now he's learning some moves. And now she becomes useful. Huh? 
But what I'm going to do, guys, I'm just going to go to the Pokemon Center. Um, and actually, I can learn him, or well, learn Mr. Bidden some moves that he should learn at level 1. Just to make him a bit more powerful. Be straight back. Okay, guys, I'm back. Um, let's go to the Pokemon Center, Miss Forbidden. Um, just learned some a couple of moves that he did learn at level one, but obviously before he evolved, before she evolved. So we've got Recover, Leech Seed, Headbutt, which is obviously withdraw. Not the strongest, but just eventually get learned some better moves. And um, also, if you still have your starter Pokemon alive, or you're just playing the, the game as normal, you speak to this gentleman here. He will give you a special move for your starting Pokemon. I can press yes. So I can use a special move. Um, I'm just going to show you a demonstrate. Um, you select that. Fire Pledge. So you learn like a, some sort of special move. And you moves. You'll find these people lurking around the area. Around the Gala region. Um, to learn stronger moves as you go. Um, but we're not going to do that. Because our kickups is actually dead. And we can't use the Pokemon anymore. So it's pretty pointless. So we're going to carry on into Route 6. There we are guys, we're at Route 6, this is where we're going to um, get our next member. We have to fight Team Yell here to be honest. So let's get... i get Chewy on. <laughs> Chewy eventually becomes the strongest member of our team. <laughs> Unfortunately, yeah, we lost kick ups and cloudy. Gained a good bond with them too. Um, cloudy was getting stronger, but unfortunately, the smoke screens we just couldn't hit the Pokemon. I could have switched out for the accuracy, but um, I, I generally thought I could have hit the Pokemon at least one more time in then two turns, but unfortunately, I didn't. And the Will O Wisp just kept on hitting me, even though it has a an accuracy rate of. I think it's 85%. But one smoke screen we still couldn't hit them, so yeah, it was just one of them. Bit unlucky really to be honest. Okay, we've got first team the Elgrunt. I don't know if we fight both of them or just the one. Okay, Chewy. These are these are pretty strong. Oh, nice damage! Nice damage. Hopefully, a bite should finish this off. Yeah. Holy crap! I took some damage off for the aftermath. Leftovers there. Alanoon. Could be so much faster than us. That has a high crit rate in slash. We're good, we're good. Paralyze, paralyze. There, nice, 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 nice. Got the paralyze. I still think it's going to be quicker than us though. Because Chubby is a very slow Pokemon. Take out, did some damage. And the Luna's out. Well done, Chewy. Well done. Nuts and bolts leveled up. Then Screech. No, don't want Screech. No, thank you. Miss Forbidden with a level. Oh, no. We are fighting the next one. Might have to switch Chewy out. We haven't time to heal him up. To be honest, the Lepard is not that strong. Um, nah. I'd... So let's rest up. Assurance. Oh, bugger. Oh, bugger. That was close. That was close. Hmm. 
Come on, wake up. Wake up now. Oh, no. Sound attacks. She keeps using this. We're going to have to switch out here. Come on, Chewie. Wake up. Come on, Chewie. Come on. We're going to feel you. Just scratching you constantly five times. You've got to wake up. Are you still asleep? Leftovers helping out a little bit there. Come on, wake up. Oh, Santa, we'll have to switch out, guys. I just, we'll wake up and we won't be able to hit him. See? Right, I've got to switch. We'll be here all day, otherwise. Um, if we could, uh, enough fighting moves. Let's go nuts and bolts. The party moves wouldn't do much of an effect on nuts and bolts. The fact that he's a steel type. So we knock him sort of tickle him. Only two. Okay. Discharge. Ah, oh, first shot's so annoying. Especially when it hits five times. Nothing, absolutely nothing. That's 80 damage? Are you kidding me? Lots of bolts needs to evolve. Oh, he missed, man! Oh, this is great. This is great. So, low accuracy again. I just. Why don't I ever hit when I, something gets lower than my accuracy? It's ridiculous. Only one sand attack. Well, I don't know if it's because of the level. That's why I'm doing not doing much damage. Or it's the fact that Nuts and Bolt is very weak. Whoa! Crap, I didn't realize I'd do that much damage. Okay, we're switching. We are switching. Chew back out. Bloody hell. Kind of trained my Pokemon a little bit and I feel like they're still bloody weak. That's a crit as well, man. It's because I've got because I've lost the two Pokemon that I would use normally against Team Yell. I would normally use Cloudy, oh, sun attack again, and I'd normally use kick ups because the fact that they've got fighting moves. And I'm missing. Holy cow, I didn't realize sun attack was so good. It's absolutely stupid. Finally! Oh, bloody time. Can't go off for a nature power. Oh, nature power. This attack makes use of nature power. Its effect very dependent on the user's environment. So what does it actually do? To be honest, the moves that I've got are actually better than. I'm guessing it was like a a condition in the battle arena. It's a better power, but I'm not going to lay on that. Sanaconda there. Oh, is that the the final evolution of Sanaconda? Yeah, well, we lay <laughs> we nearly lost some of our team members there. And that was actually tougher than I thought it would be. Was it like a Silicobra or something? Nevertheless, it's actually a decent Pokemon, decent ground type. There's a Opala Fury Gym Leader. She's actually not the next one we're going to take on. She's like, I think she's the... I think they've got one more in front of it. I think it's... I think it's the Ghost Gym that we're coming across next. Um, okay, guys, we're going to um, we're gonna set up camp. 
gonna set up camp and we're gonna make ourselves that curry. Hello guys, ah, oh, look at him there, just soaking in the sunlight. Brilliant. Hello guys. You want some food? No, we're not playing, we're not playing, we're cooking. Ah, oh, the team looks happy. Let's start cooking. Chewie's looking hungry there. Let's get some apples in there. Um, well, let's just put... Let's put 10 orange berries. We've got loads of them. Let's use them. Everyone loves an orange berry. And we put a bit of flavour in with the apple. And let's start wafting. Oh. Got some bolt smells something good. He's liking it. Oh, somebody else? Anybody else? Anybody else? Anybody else? Oh, there's... There's... Congos came. Anyone else? Oh, there's Frogger. It's there, so we've got nuts and bolts. We've got Congo and we've got Frogger, who's... I'm not surprised where Chewie is. Chewie's looking very hungry. Let's give us a good stir. Hopefully this will put everyone's HP up a little bit. Give them a bit of experience points. Oh, there's Ringworm. Put a bit of love in it. Dish complete. Everyone happy? Oh, everybody's happy. Okay, we've got ourselves an apple curry. Oh, an apple curry, that just sounds horrible. <laughs> Oh, yes. <laughs> Chewie is loving it. Okay, we got some HP. Let's... Ring room with the level up. Okay, is everybody, is everybody healthy? Everyone healed? Everybody's healed. Nice. Good stuff. That's what we wanted. That's what we wanted. Okay, we're actually... Miss Forbidden needs to get a few levels up. Depends on who we're going to come across fighting here now. Let's, let's check out these trainers. Aquaferry. 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 And got the level on it. Bloody hell. We're going to leech seed. Naturally, no. So this thing could be a f anything that's effective against us. Final gambit. What's that? Holy crap! Well, it, it was like an explosion. We nearly lost from Miss Forbidden. Oh! oh. Like, what the hell's Final Gambit? Never heard of it before, and it was a. It was like an explosion, which nearly killed us. Oh my god. Right. We need to get rid of this coffee table. <laughs> okay, we need something. Do you got any fighting? No. Hopefully Frog will land some fighting moves soon though. Right, we're just gonna get Chewy out because she's a beefy girl. Oh my god, we need a loss from this forbidden. Final Gambit. Nah, I didn't know what that move was, I've never heard of it. And that was a good fairy. If that was a good fable who did that to us, we was a Goodbye. Tim is forbidden. A metronome. You don't know what's gonna be. Tail slap. That's no. Ah, two. Come on, paralyzed. 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 Not to worry. She was getting to be an impressive Pokemon. She really is. Approach up. Oh no. That's a fight, is it? Oh, if I was a fighting move. It's dark, innit? <laughs> Could have lost Chewie there if that was a fighting move. Oh, good XP there. Got a lot of experience for that. That was close. That was a close call. Oh, there's a Doug Trio. We can't actually capture a Doug Trio, unfortunately. Okay, we're gonna skip this one. Right, this is where we're gonna get our next Pokemon. This is Route 6. 
So guys, let's go find out who we've got. This Dutch trio has to move. He keeps popping up where we want to go. Who we get any? I can't get that one. Dutch trio's in the way. We will get one though very shortly. Yeah, there's a bit more space here. Dutch trio, will you please move? It's down here. Okay, right here. Three ultra balls. Nice. Okay, come on. Who are we gonna get? Who are we gonna get? Dutch trio just keeps popping up. Here we go, we got it. Okay, a Silicobra. That's what it's called, a Silicobra. This was the one in the hidden, wasn't it? Okay, Silicobra. I'm going right, to capture this thing. Level 30. Um, let's get Kong out. I'm going to use Dig. Hopefully, this doesn't do too much damage to us. And um, that's obviously gonna miss. That's not too bad. Not too bad. Not too bad. Which is the more powerful one? Yeah, using Mega Drain. Shouldn't it? Shouldn't defeat it. I know it's super effective. Yeah, that'll do. That'll do. Sand Spirit. Sand must be his ability. Start sandstorms. Clear. Paralyze. Nice move. Good move. Good move. It's a good time we have a balance move of a, a ground type Pokemon there. That's pretty pretty good. Um, yeah, let's just chuck a Pokeball. Oh, we done it. There we have it. We have a Silicobra on the team. to the Pokedex. It spews sand from its nostrils while the enemy is blinded. It burrows into the ground to hide. Okay, okay. Um, yes, we're going to give a nickname. Right, what can we call Silicobra? What could we call him? Um, let's call our Silicobra. We're going to call her Shiva. Do you want to call her Shiva? Yeah. We can't do the part. You have to send to the box. Oh, she has a fighting type Pokemon. Oh, no. They have... She does. She has a fighting type. This could become a problem. Because we are very weak against fighting type Pokemon. I'm sure it's like a four or something. Just one of those two a fighting Pokemon sort. That's it. And the other one around the corner has a four. I think it is. This one's the more offensive one. Let's go with a fake out first. Oh, I did nothing. Same level as well. Let's go Tether Dance. Ah, it's bulking up. Bulking up, guys. After this episode, I'll have to do some more training in the wild because they're very, very low in level. Identical in levels every battle we're doing, which is not good. Oh no. No, no. Oh my god, Congo. Oh no, this is not good. This is not good at all. I have nothing. I have nothing that can do serious damage to it. Could this have been take a hit? This fight type moves effective against dragon. Hate yourself. Hate yourself. Hate yourself. No! Oh my god. All oh my days. All oh my days. This thing's gonna wipe us out. Told you, fighting types. Huh? 
is I'm trying to think now is Steel super effective against fighting. I feel like it is, but at the same time I don't know. Um uh, is it is it You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna gamble on it. It's one of them. I feel like it is, but at the same time it could not might not be effective. Hit yourself. Hit yourself. I hit himself. Oh crap it is as well. Oh there goes nuts and bolts. Oh no, no, this is not good. Oh man, okay Frogger. Um, suck punch go first. It failed. It's just bulking up. It's bulking up to take our Pokemon out. Oh, that does nothing. That does absolutely nothing. Oh my days. This thing's gonna wipe me out. Swagger. Oh no, there goes Swagger. Oh no. We're losing so many people. We are losing so many people. Over one Pokemon because of the zone the leveled. The zone the leveled. Um. It's just bulking up, so it, all its moves are going to be just one hit KOs. And its defense is going up at the same time. It's doing absolute nothing. There goes Ringworm. We're going to get wiped out here, guys. We're going to lose every single Pokemon that we have. I don't like to say it, but we are. Oh, this sucks. This sucks. There goes Miss Forbidden. It's my own fault. It was so underleveled. It's unbelievable. It was so underleveled. And this thing just kept bulking up and bulking up and bulking up. And it's... Like I said before with the fight, we are super effective. It was so bad against fighting type Pokemon. There goes Congo. We are, we're getting, we're getting the blackout. We're getting our first blackout. And we need a brand new team. Poor Chewie. There goes Double Kick. There goes Chewie. No way, that's just happened. Can't fight no more. We have our first blackout. Whole team's been defeated. Oh, man. Yes, we're healing them, but unfortunately, all six members have been killed. Oh, so, that just means... Oh my god, that. Every. <laughs> That's so annoying. Everyone.
Uh, move ringworm in. Didn't do anything with these. But I just can't switch that. So we, but we have got Shiva in our team. And that's it, guys. Every single one of our Pokemon that we've had in the series so far, unfortunately, all dead. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we only have now 10 Pokemon to try and do the series with. Hopefully, we can do that. Um, but guys, we're going to end it on, on that note. <laughs> A bad way to end the episode. The fact that we've just lost the full team. And we've just got Shiva in. Um, little baby Shiva. Um, but what I'll be doing is... Because of the rules and those like... I can't actually now catch Pokemon in the areas I've been in. My second encounters. So... I'll be I'll be doing this. Um, but I'm gonna get Silicobe all trained up first, um, and then I will do an episode of me capturing the Pokemon in these areas, just so you guys know which Pokemon that I'll be capturing to my team. It will only be a small little episode, just so you guys can see. What Pokemon I have actually got in my team for the the next longer episode, if you know what I mean. So, guys, I am going to end it on that note. Um, I hope you. I know it's hard to say, but I hope you enjoyed the episode. I know I didn't, just because the fact I've lost my full team. I just, again, it's not. It's one of them. I can't choose who I capture, and unfortunately, I said from the very beginning when we started this that I was looking very, very weak to fight in type trainers and it paid the price and it did it's shown i was very super effective against fighting type moves um so guys um, i hope you again i hope you enjoyed the episode and i will catch you on the next one